laser diode characteristics in this laser diode characteristics we have three digital meters one is voltmeter one is milliammeter the other one is milliwatt meter and also we have given laser diode and a photo detector so the beam will fall on the photo detector and the by detector we can calculate the milliwatts and also there is a 1 kilo resistance part variable part is given if you want there is also given uh, fixed resistances 100 ohms 150 ohms 220 ohms other than this you want any other resistance you want to use you can by use by varying this uh, variable part there is a dc power supply 5 volts 500 milliamps is provided on the board by which we can vary in a fine rotation part in a decibels of 0.25 steps you can easily take so i am right now getting sitting on the kit so the circuit is from positive supply to any resistance right now i am taking 100 ohms resistance then from 100 ohms resistance to milliammeter positive then from milliammeter negative to laser diode positive laser diode negative is given to dc power supply negative across dc power supply i'm connecting voltmeter positive to positive and negative to negative so we are left with photo detector that is parallelly we have to connect photo detector positive to positive and negative to negative so here you can see that 0.6 0.6 0.5 milliwatt is nothing but this uh, room's intensity if i keep any finger here you can notice that intensity has been gone so that is our room intensity okay so right now i'm varying the voltage till the uh, micrometer uh, milliammeter starts the led doesn't glows out so that is same in similarly works as a diode characteristic so pn junction led or pn junction those is the cut off ranges will be there you no know, same type similar concept is applied to laser diode characteristics so i'm applying 0.25 0 and same the room intensity you can make it as a zero intensity like this is an error you can count it as a, like it's a room room intensity okay so 0.5 still milliammeter zero still the same reading 0.75 still the same for 1 mil 1 volt same now you can see here the cut off range started so the laser intensity started so i'm keeping it to 1.25 and 0.07 milliamps and 0.7 milliwatt so the next step is 1.5 1.5 0.35 milliamps 1.3 milliwatt so the next step i'm going for 1.75 ready 1.75 0.87 milliamps 3.0 milliwatt so this is 2 volt for 2 volt 1.62 milliamps 6.3 milliwatt 2.25 sorry i left the 2.25 step 2.25 2.39 10.3 for 2.5 3.26 milliamps 15.5 watts milliwatts i'm skipping the steps because we have to go on this power supply is up to 5 volts so 3 volts 5 milliamps 21.7 3.3.5 6.75 31.6 you can see the intensity also here see on my finger the laser tip is already glowing out 
it's visible okay so again 4 volts 8.6 8 8.7 7 0 37.9 5 volts you can even go for 4.5 4.25 4.7 I'm just keeping for lengthier video so 5 volts 12.13 and 43 milliwatts so this is the laser diode characteristics we got the voltage we got the milliampere we got the wattage power as well so you have to draw the graph in between power and current voltage and uh, current and also voltage and watt meter thank you